Hi guys, there is a message on uh, Facebook about Blue Mail. Never heard about it. Super F7. There are oh, 55,000 packages out there on the AOR. I mean, well, there will always be something, right? That we don't know. P.S. I just saw a few lines here. If you're interested in testing, there is the Xanmod kernel lts edge on our repo so you can just sudo pacman i've done it on my uh, well three systems here the iso builder and as you can see virtual box so it's as simple as sudo pacman minus s xenmod and it is told and uh, they say that the uh, xenmod will not work with nvidia but two of my systems have nvidia cards so go and have a look at the xenmod and xenmod lts and xenmod edge if you dare to install it know how to uninstall it if everything breaks for you topic of the video blue mail hmm control t yay blue mail what's this all about it's on the aor so aor means you build it yourself one enter and then it's going to receive a package build well maybe we should show you document it control h cache yay blue mail that's what's happening any aor helper paru yay and so on trizen they have a place somewhere where they start building a recipe this is cooking building a package package build done blue mail difference to show show no none and it goes on building everything getting the source and if it gets he finds the source okay then it starts building and all kind of things and in the end result it's going to go to the package folder and from the package folder it goes to something to install and you say yes install me now sometimes you know we walk away and you say oh yeah right I started building half it takes half an hour to build something right and you come back and you say oh my god it's not there the yes it's here all you need to do is keep that package somewhere safe and say from time to time on a new machine for example right install me this blue mail thing that i've built a month ago a week ago what is blue mail blue mail okay best email experience ever made for all right fine and then you need to sign in gmail yahoo hotmail outlook comcast aol life a lot of things things i've never heard about well voila there it is lots of things and you start um logging in maybe i kind of can find some dummy kind of thing to, to log in and to show you so let me pause the recording right i've used the article info at gmail.com which is the official mail for article it was empty anyway so that's okay but it's not empty anymore right because hey i signed in and he knows thanks you for signing in please confirm and that's um a wrap meaning delete some security alerts i went i had to log in and then admit kind of per some permissions I had to switch on off um, the normal drill right connecting to your google account and then giving it permissions and then i can now check all my things in this virtual machine with blue mail there's a calendar their contacts help center layout options compact and stuff and settings dark mode light mode date and time all kinds of things to change calendar monday day all good for me sync unlimited all kind of account settings notification signatures magic sync wanted to sync something between your active device and any new device so if probably if you want 
if you have already synced it, let's say you have 20 accounts on a computer, number one, you go to the other computer, number two, you install Blue Mail, and I believe then this would be syncing then between both machines. That's what I'm guessing without reading anything. So take a look, guys. Blue Mail is um, an app, it's down here as well. And um, if you say, oh, I'm gonna try it, why don't you? All right, cheers.